Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to vlog number three. I just arrived in LA and in this one I'll show you my preparation for the Nogi Rules, the biggest tournament I've fought up until now. So you'll see me training, eating, uh, not so much unfortunately, uh, and relaxing in the weekends to get my head a little bit clear. And that's it, a lot of sparring footage, enjoy! So when I'm approaching a, a tournament and I need to make weight, I like to take the carbs out of my breakfast so I don't eat as much and with the protein I feel a little bit more stuffed. I'll just use some, some veggies to fill out the plate. It's not as tasty as my oatmeal or some other of the other breakfasts I make but you gotta do what you gotta do to, um, to get on the weight. Fun fact about Brazilian Portuguese, actually normal Portuguese as well. The breakfast, literally the meal breakfast translates to morning coffee. So of course I have to have a cup of black coffee. Fun fact number two, Brazilian coffee is not so good because they export all the good coffee. So those stuff you buy in the supermarket is... So trying to get my injury over as fast as I can. After every training I will take an ice bath and at the end of the day I'll take a contrast bath so now I'm putting my foot in um, a bucket with ice for about 15 minutes and I'll do that again after the evening training uh, if I go I might just do strength training instead but still I'm still gonna put my foot in the bath and then before I go to bed I'll, I'll take a contrast bath so I'll put one bucket with ice and the other bucket with hot water so I'll do two 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 starting with cold water and ending with warm water as my physiotherapist recommended. So the main thing I try to keep in mind while I'm injured uh, is to do what I can. So when I'm training Jiu Jitsu, I'm just playing positions that are uh, safe for my injured toe, uh, which is mainly half guard, which I usually don't like. It's always good to study something uh, when you're injured to make the best of it. So I'm already progressing a little bit and my coaches uh, are helping me a lot. Yeah, I was really good at half guard. You learn a lot from, uh, from Lucas Lage. Uh, and another thing I like to do is uh, some yoga. I can still do most of the poses uh, that I'm used to. Uh, just to be a little bit careful with my food. So uh, it keeps me busy as long as I'm here. Okay, so that was another competition class. Uh, we did some specific sparring from mount, um, a lot of normal rounds, 10 minute rounds, no gi. And with the gi, um, you'll see me get my ass kicked by, uh, by Gabriel in this video. So to get through the weight cut, I'll have some zero calorie spray. <laughs> not eat as much carbs and the worst uh, part of it all not have dessert. Yeah, and Orlando is also on the vertical diet. Mm. Getting everybody vertical. Look how strong he is. 
Just vertical eating, people. Just vertical eating. Okay, guys, so still on a weight cut. Lots of vegetables. I'm gonna not eat all the white rice and have some sweet potatoes instead. And of course, you gotta have the steak if you are on the vertical diet. Hope you guys like that one. Next week I'll introduce you guys to my coach, Gabriel Holo, also known as Polito. I'll show him uh, doing a super fight in Sao Paulo. Uh, I'll let him share some knowledge with you guys and of course you'll see him kicking my ass. So see you next week.